Good morning, everyone. David Cook, DeFranco Painting and Wallpaper, and we are here in Del Webb, Sun City, Elgin, actually. So there's this customer's view. It's a beautiful view outside their patio. Anyway, we are painting before they move in. Seems to be a trend for us here in the last uh, four months of doing a lot of these before they move in projects, which we love because we can really make an impact and be quick on the work that we're doing and efficient in our time, not moving stuff out of the way. So that's always nice. Um, so uh, they're doing three colors, uh, 6103, 6104, 6113, I think are the three. I don't remember off the top of my head, but um, the kitchen is a color and the foyer is a color and then they're putting a chair out at some point so we're just going to put a tape line and paint below that and then when the chair comes in it'll be done kind of what they're looking for uh the main area is the kiln beige i think and then all the bedrooms are that same color so it's pretty easy as far as color wise the red i think will cover in two coats um the beige it's not too dark but i think it'll cover pretty well so uh, we did our estimate beforehand. Uh, we don't have to worry about painting trim because it was all done not too long ago. So it's ceilings and walls. So some of the things uh, Jose's been working on is painting, uh, patching stress cracks. There's been a ton of them. Um, they hit some big ones on the walls. It was really weird. So he was working on those yesterday and today and get some ceilings done. Um, then again, you can just see the colors, like the mint green's going away. The red is going away. This peachy color is going away. Yellow is going away. They're keeping handles, keeping those drapes. Um, there was a big curtain right up there we took off. Uh, the blinds are staying. The window sills, for some reason when they redid the house, uh, they left the wood window sills. It's really weird. Um, but we're gonna sand these down. I put some Extreme Bond Primer on there and then paint it white. Uh, to match the trim and then in the master bedroom bathroom uh, there's some more of these large ceiling stress cracks you can see up there which Jose is fixing there's another one just a weird drywall one there kind of the same thing and again curtain rods that were there is going away Jose's patching away um, master closet it's just staying white and then yellow in the bathroom and then this mint green's going away um, so, um, nice neutral colors going back in, so it'll be good. Um, again, no furniture. <clears throat> so, Jose's just, uh, uh, he's got one guy coming to help tomorrow. We are, got caught up in another project, so he's solo today. But, uh, today's Tuesday. He was in here yesterday just drywall mudding, so he's doing second coats on that. Ceiling trim today. Ceiling trim on some of the doors that are getting done. Um, so he'll be... Um, getting to the point where he'll be putting ceiling paint on today and getting some cut in on some of the main areas. So that'll be good. Um, and then five days. So the goal is this house, I don't know the model number. If I can think of it, I'll tag it. Um, but <clears throat> this model, you know, two guys a week and we're having everything painted. So it's not too, too terrible. I've got questions on how we can paint um, your home before you move in, while you're moving in, selling. Uh, just wanting to change up some colors. Let us know. Love to see how we can help you love the space you're in. You guys have a great day and God bless.